One of the thoughts that has been festering in my brain is the fact that should I win the election, should I actually become district attorney, everyone would know that it was Capwell money that bought the position. Daddy will be very disappointed if you don't run. No, <laughs> I know. Mason, he's been talking about this for years. Yeah, first to Channing, later to me. You know, you don't need to keep comparing yourself to Channing. Mm, no, I don't need to. I do it compulsively. Some people like to pull the wings off flies. I like to compare myself to my godlike brother. You know, Dad called him the toast of two continents. Sometimes a phrase like that gets burned into your brain like a brand on a bull. I think this is just a bad day for you. I think it has a lot to do with you not getting any sleep. Yeah, I whooped it up all night. <laughs> you like her? <laughs> what is her name? Oh, Miss Patricia Hampton. Well named, come to think of it. Night with her is like a week in the country. But our father thinks of her as a tramp. Oh, you're fine. Your taste in women is fine. Look, you do exactly what you want about running for district attorney. <laughs> I think you're saying I have your permission to be me. Exactly. You know me a good deal better than I usually allow myself to be known, Kelly. I would appreciate it if you kept your insights to yourself. That you didn't even tell your soon-to-be husband, Peter? You can trust me. You like Peter Mason? Yeah, quite a lot. I only wish that he liked you as much as he likes being one of the Capwells. Now, once we start being honest with each other, Kelly, we can't just go back to being polite, can we?